In this video, I will show you how to deactivate the debug mode in WordPress. As you can see in this example, there are a few notices displayed here at the very top in my admin dashboard, and that's because the debug mode is currently fully enabled on my site. In this particular method, I'll show you how you can deactivate the debug mode directly through the file manager. And as usual, before proceeding with the steps shown in this video, please make sure to have a full backup copy of your WordPress site, including the database. Once that's done, log into your hosting account and then go to control panel area such as cPanel and then look for the file manager. Go ahead and open it. Once it loads, look for the root directory where your WordPress is installed. Usually it's within the public underscore HTML. Let's go ahead and click on it. Right in here, you'll see a list of folders and files such as WP admin content includes. And the file of interest is this one, wp-config.php. Let's go ahead and right click on it and then click on edit. Once the editor loads, scroll down roughly until the line 75, which is right here. In fact, let me just zoom in a little bit. And then look for the following constant, define wp underscore debug. Currently it's enabled, so it's set as true. In order to deactivate it, let's change it to false. Just like this. And if you have any other debug constants like debug log, debug display, you can also change them to false. In fact, let me do it right now. Let's change both of them. Uh, now let's save changes. Now let's go back to the WordPress dashboard and let's try refreshing it. And as you can see that the notices are no longer visible on the website because the debug mode is fully deactivated. So that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you found it helpful. For more WordPress tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.